I think I have the mental capacity for a couple more missions here or tasks. Because I am starving. Revelio. Hmm. All right, butterflies. Do you think Elizabeth? This cannot possibly be. Okay. Wasn't there something I could have done to these Lumos. guys? I can't remember. Mike, didn't they fight each other or do they just mess around by themselves? Revelio. The headmaster hates everyone who isn't a pure blood Ah. I don't know why I'm being space bar. What a statue bears the likeliness of a Anger Dawn. Fearless feline mouse hunter. Okay. Clearly has no interest in here. Where's the dogs? I like dogs. Well, that's uh, a, a man that got crushed by a troll. This set of armor belonged to Sir Andalthrop. The heedless who unwisely challenged a mountain troll to a game of musical chairs. Oh. Hey Sebastian, we can go to town Hello, now. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? Yes, sir. It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. You're the best of guides. Self-contained, too. You're the guidiest of guides. We should be able to find you everything Here's Sebastian you Swallow. Need. Follow? Shall we? Follow. Uh, existence. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. Oh, yeah? Why? As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it... Bested you? No. I murdered you, okay? Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. Speaking of uh, detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Uh, I'm stuck. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, <sighs> and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. I can't sprint any faster. So Gosh, when can I fly? Get on the librarian's bad side. Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section. Ooh, and shiny. I, on the other hand, I'm inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. Okay, They're got them. to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Thanks for the heads up. I got it though. I'm fine. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? Ah. Uh, see for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Absolutely. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. You good? You out of breath? Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Ruins? Where? 
Have you had oh. much of a chance to explore the castle? A little. It's positively enormous. Oh yeah, it's large. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? Spill your beans. You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Is as eventful. Yes? Ah. Uh, giddy. Give me break. Oh yeah, that's healing. Uh. Need to break over. Mr. Moon, he's the Hogwarts caretaker. Oh, this guy right he's here. A bit worse for oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. <gasps> what did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I Is shall right? be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his what? pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. Mm -hmm. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. I think it was funny. Mr. Moon. What are we midday here? Character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. Revelio. She's not well, but she'll be better soon. Yep. And back Why do I keep in spacebar? Hogs me. The only all wizard village in Britain. Oh, give. There we go. Oh, kitty break. Ah, you got a split face. If one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We oh, yeah. all flock to it like moths to a flame. I was standing behind a till counting knuckles. Are you trying to sound like a romantic? It's a precariously stacked set of cauldrons outside the Erdwin advertises to the shop wares. Eh. We here? So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get. Yeah, one on one. A wand and some other bits. One on one. Yes. Ditany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Dit. Perfect. Any seeds? Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for myself. Is there somebody behind me? Who's this Let's lady up talking to? Circle when you're finished. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Uh, yeah, um, I'm... You done talking to yourself? Why? I think there is a voice coming out of her mouth, though. Because we... Ooh, cat, 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 gonna pet the cat.
Not all yourself. Right, okay. Uh, let's get, uh... Ah. Oh, Vanders is, like, right there. Oh, it's in front of my face. <laughs> Merlin, blooming beard. Not again. Don't mind me. Just gonna open up your things here. Wonder if this is like one to one from Harry Potter, the original, like first movie. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, ah, yeah, me. Just a moment, please. Ah, uh, hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, uh, no, no. I want that one no, right there. You. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Swish what? Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. The one said no. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. Yeah? The rare well, wood? 13, 13 and a quarter th inches. Oh, dragon quarters. heart string? I was going to say three fourths. Let's give this one a try. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. Oh, yeah? How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, you? There you are. Ah, the green box up top. Yes. I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Yeah, okay, let's take it. Is this the one? Is it the one? The one. It looks boring. Ah, I will change the one into one I like. Was it like Ashwood? How intriguing. What's intriguing? Ooh. I think I like this one. Curious indeed. How curious are we talking about? Bruce? Oh, we could really How intriguing. change it. I like apples. Thirteen and a half. Fourteen and a half. Curious indeed. I don't think the wand changes in size very much. Yeah, we'll, we'll go fourteen and a half. Flexibility, quite bendy. How intriguing. Supple, solid. Unyielding, yes. Uh, mm, uh, dragon heart string. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what we want. What do you think? Gonna grab food, BRB. Grab me some too. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah.
Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. I mean, yeah, I Though chose I it myself. We'll learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Oh, no, I mean, you just sold me a wand, and I don't think anything else changes from there. Okay, gotta go to another shop. Um... There should be one to the left somewhere. I think I need to get a cauldron, didn't I? No, I didn't need to. Uh, visit PJ's potion. Can I find any of these without the map? Yep, potions. Welcome to J. Pippin's potions. Yep, I'm right here. What's up? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here no, before you haven't. either. I'm new. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. Yeah. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion I wouldn't know. that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also mm. offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. All right. But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? I mean, you're just not giving to me anyway, so... Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Oh no, I'm or broke. Come back another time <laughs> if you're in a rush today. I don't have a single cent to my name. You want me to buy stuff? Ah, yeah, I, I, can sell, I can sell this old stuff. Do me a favor. Um, gold rimmed circular spectacles. I got, I got some that I like. Thank you. Sweet, made money, got free stuff, awesome. I think the seed place in the, is in the far back. That way? And it's starting to look correct to me now. Oh, there's a bench there. Didn't see it. Hello, I like your cap. Can I have it? Okay, that's probably not the place you need to go to. Dogweed and death cap. I need to go for tomes and magic neeps. Just because you know Luma. Accio. Missed it. Where'd it go? Revelio. Ah, there Accio. you are. <laughs> this is me stalling getting off because I want to eat. I 
thing. No, that's not where I need to go. Devil. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna give up. I'm gonna open up the map. I'm gonna figure out where I need to go. Deeply in Suns. Dogs meet square. Dukes. Sporting needs. Uh, I don't need tomes and scrolls. Right at the entrance. Are you kidding me? Oh, wait, the magic need. I went up here. Oh, it was over. Okay. I'm good. Perfectly fine. Mentally destroyed. Got it. I can swim, right? Yeah. Hello there. Hello. Hi. Give me seeds. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively real. I don't like your voice. Why does it sound like you're talking in a tuna can? I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, see that page. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. What's and this is my Timothy? shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Yes, sir. I need the Dittany's. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. No. Nope. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest. Why is everything so major. expensive? I sold clothes for like 30 cents or whatever. Repair. They mean to do that. Revelio, please. Thank you. The magic need card. Okay, well, we, we know already know that belongs to him. I mean, he's right next to it. Okay, one last thing here. Oh, I'm so drained. <sighs> It it's got half a chance. Hello oh there, Thomas Brown. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. Did you? I am the proprietor here, Thomas Brown. Hmm. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That certainly. I think she's already to, impressed. I look forward to that day. And I too see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, mm -hmm. sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? You act like you're selling me something. You're not. You just give it to me. If you're interested, feel that's free so to take expensive. a look around at the rest of my inventory. Well, that's everything. A thousand. Go and find Sebastian. Ah. Uh, oh. Okay. Revelio. I can. 
craft potions. You change the stairway and the scrolls reveal itself when a particular book is moved. Okay, what book? But yeah, anyways, uh, what I was kind of just getting the idea of what, the, what he was shopping about is some cauldrons, especially the more expensive ones, allow me to make more potions simultaneously. Wait, can I, can I not go up there? Revelio. Oh, look, uh, your personal chest that I'm just gonna barge into. Don't mind me. Yo, what, you got a wall full of books? Come on. I'm curious if this actually moves. I know I can get up there. I know it. I should be able to get up there. I just don't know how. Okay, anyways. Hey, Sebastian, head back. Go eat. Excuse me, coming through. Hey, is that Willy Wonka? Hey, Willy! Oh, you're not Willy. Oh, look, it's Willy Wonka. Oh, wait. Look, it's Willy Wonka. Oh, there's a lot of Wonkas. That's Sebastian. I have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed, from your sister? <clears throat> I did. Hey, so I welcome back, Aiden. Oyster now. Let's <sighs> see what else we can get up to. <sighs> Ch -ch Just save those and just do that, and then yeah, okay. Uh oh. Oh. Dude, you're in my face. Personal space. Okay, sure. To uh, demonologist later. Nice. Okay. Demonist. Demonologist. Goodness. Yay me. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. 
Of course, oh, officer. God, Singer. I gotta clean up too. Officer Singer. And thank you again. I, oh, oh, what? Okay, you're gonna ask me to clean up and then you're gonna dip out. What's that's just messed up. Lucky they didn't do more damage. I took out a troll I'll and I gotta clean up. Chores, am I right? Ugh. Aiden, what'd you eat? Repairer. Better not have been a peanut butter jelly sandwich. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Revelio. Ingus the Woodcroft? Repero. Repero. I done yet? No, I'm not. Now I'm done. Papa John. Oh, I wish I'm Papa Jones. Oh, you're now. <laughs> Hello the there. Singing your praises. You got any freebies for me? Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. <laughs> Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. <laughs> but I can offer you something much more useful. Oh. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. Ah, uh, you have enchanted and clothes, just say that. this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, just give it to thank me. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, Yo, he has a high pitch in this voice. Plenty for your perusal today. Uh, Take your time. Singular robe. You received a new piece of gear. Time to equip it. Yes, please. Give me my mouse so I can do it. You don't need a. Ooh, I got other pieces of gear too. <laughs> the Bane mask. I was born in the dark. <laughs> I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. Hello. Hello. Okay, so I had some more armor. Where do I equip that at? Inventory. Yeah? No. Uh, do I just hit I? Yeah. I hit I on the keyboard. Equip my scar. Equip whatever I got. Wait. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, those some uh, awkward pajamas, too. Thanks, I hate it. I think I, I think I can uh, cosmetic change appearance. There we go. This is Death Eater mask or something. Ew. You know, you know what? Actually, I think these take away from me not having an eyebrow. <laughs> Perfect. Sebastian, wait up! Sebastian! Holmes! Three broomsticks, huh? Assuming it isn't huh? utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Why are we walking so slow? We, okay. You 
said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> oh no, That's the fine. child in question. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Three broomsticks? It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. I don't like her voice. Now, what can I... Oh. There's oh. a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Please, thank you. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. Please, please. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh, it's right there. Not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't Ooh, do that burn. if I were Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Oh, why do you want me? I don't know you. My friend Stranger is enjoying danger. a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink galleons, huh? forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. <laughs> no. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that uh, note, I think we should head back to the You ask me because I don't got no eyebrows, okay? I was, I was just born this way. <laughs> Rebellion. The three broomsticks, guide pages. Yeah, okay. So when I leave, did I got a sneak out. I mean, it sounded like he was just gonna jump me as soon as I walked out. Or not? Lucky. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Harlow. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Sebastian, Sebastian, you and your detention. Select Hogwarts map. Yes, I will. Fast travel to your common room. Good thing you have a jumping over there. I want to know what to click on if it wasn't for the indicator saying I need to go there. Just sleep in your uniform. Fair enough. Ooh, 
and a level. Apparently I'm getting levels and I didn't even know it. Way out. New quest available. Escape. Hmm. Don't see me. I discovered something in the locket we found in Gringotts. At Gringotts. Okay, here we go. Ryan, come on, move, 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 move. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Did you? Ed, I'm hungry. Feed me. I got this like, you know, problem. It's like, you know, you're hungry, but you seem to not take care of yourself. Mostly it's just, I don't want to cook right now. <laughs> I suppose. I mean, is it lazy? I mean, I'll eat the food. I mean, that's not lazy. I just don't want to cook. Professor Fig, as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can believe. Professor Weasley insists that they will need an escort and a mentor to help them acclimate or acclimize before term begins i have assigned the task to you please see professor weasley for details professor venus nicholas black headmaster Did i say his name right i don't even think i said his name right i said it wrong Procrastination? No, 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 no. It's not procrastinate. Okay, maybe, it, maybe it is. Yeah, I just like sat here on the floor waiting for him to come, like to arrive, and he's just gonna go right Professor, to work. <laughs> I'm glad to see you, and I you. Thank Merlin, you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. One piece. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? how? And why send trolls to? They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. Oh, if Ranrock's guys. goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. They're after the locket. Yes, the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library, a restricted section to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Should we go? I appreciate you your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit, before we continue. But sir, how dangerous mm. could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. Yes, sir. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, I, got, I can't collect that right now. Okay, 